Okay, I wanted to see if I could take uh, the Boston City salary data, um, the JSON file, and load it into R and manipulate it. So um, this is the Boston uh, salary data. Oops, sorry, I should. Uh, no, that's no good. Um, salary data. Let me just uh, drop it into. So you remember it's got metadata for ages and then the real data somewhere down down here uh, and this is labeled as uh, it's part of an object uh, called data. Okay, so I'm trying in R to pick that up. So the things I need to do uh, first, um, I need to be able to read JSON and I need to basically do the following two. I need to install packages rjson and then uh, load the library rjson. So I'm working in R here and uh, here I've got uh, install our JSON which I've done and then library our JSON. Okay so then I need to load the file and here let me just show you in notepad because it's easier to see I'm loading my file and I give it the full file name on my system and I need to put uh, double slashes uh, as usual and here from our JSON and now result will contain everything. Now the problem is that I need to pick out just the object called data and so I'm loading it into result and now I want to pick out and I called it salary but it's actually the whole row so salary uh, gets let me go and uh, so let's have a look here I've got results now this one actually results data is what I need and let me put that into salary okay so I do salary results and then double bracket data okay so here now we can imagine we've got rows and the length of each row is 20 and it so happens that the 19th element is the maximum salary. So what I'm pulling out here is the maximum salaries for each person. So I'm feeding in salary and here's my callback function. Uh, it's a little different to JavaScript but it's uh, pretty straightforward and I pick out the 19th element and save it. So S now is basically a list of all the salaries and it turns out they're strings and so to plot a histogram I need to convert them to integers. So that's what this does and if we look at our graph we get this histogram of uh, basically all the salaries and you see these go up to 200,000 here 300,000. So now we could manipulate uh, this data fairly easily um, in R. Okay.